Next thing I want to show you, it is the variable description. So right now, your variables don't have any description. I open the terminal, run terraform apply, and you see it's asking for policy count for this variable, but you don't have any idea what this variable does. I want to change it. So I press Ctrl C to cancel Terraform apply. I go to VS Code and right here I write description. For value I write description for policy string. And for policy count I write description number of policies to create. The descriptions are ready. I open the terminal. I run Terraform apply again. And look now, it's asking me for policy count and it also describes me what this variable does. So it is the number of policies to create. I will write, for example, one that I want one policy. Right now, I have two policies, number zero, number one. And when I write here one, it means one policy from here will be deleted and it will be the last one. So policy number one will be deleted. Go into the terminal, I press enter. And now it's asking me for policy description. I have the description. So it is explaining me what this variable does. In the policy description, I have to write the same policy description I wrote before. So I open the state file. I find here the policy string. That is this one. I copy the description. I passed it in the terminal. I run it and you see what's happening. It is going to destroy policy number one. This is this one, policy number one, that one. And that is all, only one item to be destroyed. I write yes, enter. It happened, the policy number one got destroyed. I refresh the page and I see here policy number zero and policy string. Also, I have the description here. Let's add the files to the stage. I updated variables TF, I add it to descriptions, add it to the stage, write the commit message, edit description input variables. Edit description for input variables. Better, new line, input variables. That is ready, commit.